What up, yoys and girls? I just wanted to come on here and I guess have a little story time. Uh, I haven't really been in front of the camera much recently. Been making kind of random videos, not talking much. I uh, just wanted to get back to my roots and tell you guys, I guess, why I joined cross country. Looking back to where it all started, I guess, uh, senior year of high school, I was in track. I was in track all four years of high school and I never really took it super serious. I was always just running to stay in shape for soccer or basketball, any other sport, never really focusing on track individually. But my senior year, every other sport was done, so I knew that track was kind of a serious thing. So I focused a little bit, little bit more on that and just running the mile a little faster, running some two miles, and just enjoying my time because I thought I was going to be done. Thought I wasn't going to be racing anymore in my life. Thought I was just going to be, be a runner, I guess, after, after school. Come the summer after my senior year and before my freshman year of college, I wanted to race a half marathon. Um, I was just running every day. I think I would run after work maybe two to three times a week and I would run as fast as I could for three to six miles depending on the day. I'd just run five, 530 pace for as long as I could and then come home and feel really happy about myself and really happy where I was. And then I ran the half marathon and I got I think an hour 19 and I was pretty happy with that time. I went into it thinking, oh, maybe I could get hour 25, hour 30. And then I looked down at my watch around a mile in and I was going 530 pace. So I thought I would average it out to six, six flat pace. And I think that's about where I finished at. So I was pretty happy with that. Um, then come that same summer, I was just working, about to start school for the first year. And my high school coach, he called me and he recommended that I race at college, run at college. Uh, I never did cross country or anything, so I didn't really know what it entailed. I told him, uh, no thanks, I just wanna focus on school because I never really planned on doing any running in college. Just wanted to stay in shape. But then uh, I really sat back and thought about it. Maybe I, maybe I should try it out, it's college, try something out and then if you don't like it, uh, you can you can leave. So then my coach got in contact with the coach here and he called me almost immediately because they had camp that was starting in three days. So I uh, signed all the forms pretty quickly and got kicked it into high gear and I made it to camp within three days. I made it to school, was all ready for everything, I guess. I think it was a week or two early than the earlier than the actual start of the school year. So going into my freshman year, um, I never knew runners, knew anything about running really. I just ran and ran to have fun or ran, uh, ran just because and I think until this past year, I never really took it super seriously. I was just always the guy hanging out and made fun of made fun of running a little bit, just lighthearted uh, jokes about it. But I think uh, looking back and looking forward, I think it is something that is super influential for my life and many others around the world. And I think it's great to just have something that's so easy to do. You just put on some shoes and you can run anywhere in the world and it doesn't matter who you are what you're doing everyone can run everyone can get better so I think that's what really appealed to me and then come freshman year I joined the team and my coach said if you like camp you can stay if not you can leave and I don't know if that was a trap or not because camp was a lot of fun and I didn't have to do much running because I was just getting into the swing of things. People were running 50, 60 mile weeks. I was running maybe uh, 20 mile weeks with a lot of biking. So I did a lot of that and uh, I loved my freshman year. A lot of the guys, really older guys, took me under their wing and I really appreciate that from them. Um, I hope I have done the same for the younger guys in my in my time here. But... 
I just wanted to say that I really fell in love with cross country and the, the sport all around. And I really believe I'll be racing the rest of my life, marathons, ultras, half marathons, anything, hopefully racing with my kids some days. Uh, I don't have one right now, <laughs> hopefully in some, some day soon. I think uh, I didn't take it seriously because I never thought I was a great runner. I never thought I could go anywhere with it. And I think mentally, I never really appreciated the talent I had, I guess, because a lot of the guys come in and they work really hard and I feel I work really hard. But I feel like I was already at an advantage and I felt bad that I was already there when people were also putting in so much work. But I didn't want to get discouraged by that and I stuck with it through these past four years and I've loved every minute of it. I don't think I don't think I could have made it through college without it or without the friendships and bonds I've made because people that I've met are so great and I just know the running community is such a great community as a whole. Um, I don't know if you noticed, my hair grew in a little bit. I look like a Chia pet, kinda. So let me know down in the comments if you're still watching. Hopefully you wanna hear my journey, but dog me in the comments on it. Uh, I just wanted to come on here and talk about why I joined, mostly for myself, uh, hopefully for others who don't know going into college, going into high school if you're watching, doing anything, I would say, take the risk, please take the risk. Um, I went into college with so many friends because of this camp had, I don't know, 50 people there and that was already a big group, big community that I came in with. And I think without that, I don't even know if I would have made it through college. So I just wanna thank everyone around me and my parents for everything. Uh, just kind of reflecting on this the past couple months and knowing that I won't race any cross country races anymore. Uh, just a sad feeling, but also a good feeling knowing that I'll be able to still train, hopefully the rest of my life and get better in certain ways and improve my improve my running and my mental to hopefully new heights each and every year or month, depending on what my goals are. I just want you guys to really go out there no matter what it was, whether it's a sport that you haven't tried, a task you haven't done. I want you to take, take that risk and, and just go for it because I wouldn't be the man I am or the place or where I am right now without doing cross country. So I want to thank everyone who has helped me through everything. Thank you guys for supporting me through all this. Uh, keep watching the videos. I love you all very much. And hopefully you guys keep supporting and sharing the videos. Like down below. Um, I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next one. See ya.